Hello, hello, good evening, Francisco, how are you? Good evening, teacher, uh, very good, and you, teacher? I'm just fine, just fine, here, ready. How are you? And good, teacher, good, good. Excellent, how was your day? Uh, pues, a heavy day, teacher. Uh, As usual. El, ¿Cómo se dice lo usual? As usual. As usual. As usual, teacher. Lo usual de todos los días. Yeah, I understand you. But what we gonna do? ¿Qué le vamos a hacer, no? Ley de la vida. Yeah, I mean. It's okay. It's part of regular activities, ¿no? Es parte de lo mismo de siempre. Yes, teacher. Okay, and tell me, well, tomorrow is the last day of class. So after tomorrow, you're going to rest a little bit, right? Después de mañana, descansar un poquito. Me perdí, me perdí por un momento. Okay, tomorrow is the last day of class. Ah, okay. So, after that, you're going to relax a little bit. Después de eso, a relajarse un poco. ¿Cuántos, ¿Cuántos días? I don't know, one week. Ah, okay. Mañana última clase, ¿verdad, teacher? Yes, yes, it is. Okay. Yes, tomorrow is the last one. ¿Y en el siguiente módulo sería usted mismo o otra persona, teacher? Mm, I, I mean, I would like to be with you guys. A mí me gustaría continuar con ustedes, but you know, Clara called and said, nah, no, teacher. Yes, yes, teacher. Yeah, yes. It's, it's probably that I continue with you. 
So sorry for you, Clara. Very good. <laughs> we will see, we will see. I mean, the thing is this, look, uh, it's good for a teacher with to be with the same group, like two, three modules. Es bueno para un maestro estar con un grupo, dos o tres módulos. After that, it's better if you change teacher. Después de eso, es mejor si usted cambia. Because, I mean, uh, the situation is that you need, like, uh, to be listening different styles, different accents. Ustedes necesitan entrar en contacto con diferentes estilos, acentos. I mean, I'll be honest with you. It just happened once that I took one course, like, for six modules. Creo que solo una vez tomé un curso como por seis módulos. On a row. Seguidos. But, I mean, it was a special case. Un caso especial. Usually after two or three, I change. And sometimes they change me after the very first one. Y a veces me toca cambio del primero. Uh, it's funny, you know. Uh, 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 I, I am uh, like certified to work with all the levels. Yo estoy certificado para trabajar con todos los niveles. But they love sending me to the basics. Pero les encanta mandarme con los básicos. <laughs> it's, I mean, to be honest with you, the basic ones are the hardest. Para ser honesto, estos son más, are heavier for, for, for us as teachers, para nosotros como docentes. But also are the most interesting, pero al mismo tiempo son los más interesantes. Because, I mean, here you really, really can't, can can see the results. Acá sí se pueden percibir muy, muy bien los resultados. Because, Pero I mean, es más pesado, teacher. Si, si en teoría, digamos, tendría que ser más fácil o no. No, guys. <laughs> Look at this. Veanlo desde el punto de vista. Do you remember the activity from yesterday? ¿Se acuerda de la actividad de ayer? No, ayer no estuve yo. Okay. Yesterday, your classmates were creating conversations. Ayer sus compañeros estuvieron creando conversaciones. Okay. One month ago, the whole class was almost me speaking. Hace un mes la clase, hace un mes la clase entera era yo hablando casi todo el tiempo. I mean, uh, now the class is you speaking, you practicing, you doing exercises. Uh, but to get you to this point, llevarlos a este punto, I mean, it's the little bit heavier because sometimes, I mean, it's not that you cannot. A veces no es que ustedes no puedan. It's just that uh, I need to push you. Hay que empujarlos un poquito. Because, I mean, you can do it. It's just a matter of, of pushing you. Uh, I have to make you believe in yourselves. Toca hacer los que crean en ustedes mismos. Because, I mean, I know some of you that at the beginning were like very afraid. Sé que algunos al inicio estaban muy, muy temerosos. And it's not that today is easy. Y no es que ahora sea súper fácil. But I don't notice that much fear. No veo tanto miedo. I don't see that much nervousness. Eh, no veo tanto nerviosismo. And, but to get some students to get to this point, some teachers find it pretty difficult. Algunos maestros lo consideran muy... Pesado. Eh, solo que eh, but you explain very well, teacher. Yeah, as I told you, I've been with this a long while. He estado en esto mucho tiempo. <laughs> and it's funny, you know, uh, uh, weekends I teach, but I go to the other point on the weekend. El fin de semana tengo una clase que es todo lo opuesto. I'm teaching, uh, uh, I am preparing some students for TOEFL. Estoy preparando alumnos para TOEFL. So it's, it's after advanced. Eso es después de los avanzados. So it's, it's good. Actually, it's a very good experience. And I don't know why. Uh, for me, uh, I like working with basics. A mí me gustan los básicos. They're cool. It's good to make, uh, to deal with all the little things that happen here. Es interesante tratar todas las cosas que pasan acá. And also, I mean, it helps me to practice more. Me ayuda a practicar más también. Because I, I need to be 
to be aware of my pronunciation, my accent. Tengo que prestarle más atención a mi pronunciación, mi acento. To vocalizing properly. Eh, vocalizar de la manera correcta. I mean, the thing is this. Look, if I'm speaking like fast, uh, the way in which I put my mouth is different. Si se fija cuando comienzo a hablar rápido, casi ni abro la boca. But when I'm teaching basics, I'm vocalizing everything. Pero cuando estoy con los básicos, estoy vocalizando completo. And that's good. That's even good for me. Eso también es bueno para mí. En my person, el English is somewhat, eh, ¿cómo, es ese, ¿cómo se dice complicado? Complex. Complex. Nah, you know, actually, English is easier than Spanish. Es más fácil que el español. En lo personal, quizás porque a mí el inglés, desde que lo comencé a ver, quizás nunca como que me llamó quizás la atención cuando estuve, digamos, de sexto a noveno en bachillerato. Ahora más que todo, digamos, por, por el trabajo. Yeah, it's normal, but I mean, slowly you, and steady you are getting it. Poquito a poco, ahí vamos. And that's good. Yes. Yes. Hey, Francisco, nice talking to you and welcome. Thank you, teacher. So, Clara, hello, how are you? How's everything? Hello, teacher. Uh, very good. How was your day? And the same routine. The same routine, same old routine. Eh, don't worry, don't worry. <laughs> don't worry. I mean, that's normal. Everybody is in the same situation. Todos vamos en la misma situación. Yes. We are in the same boat. Vamos en el mismo barco. <laughs> yes. And tell me. Okay. Tomorrow, last class. What you gonna do after that? ¿Qué va a ser los días de descanso? Tell me, tell me, tell me. Um, listen music English. Listen to English music. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. <laughs> Para que se me vaya quedando un poquito más palabras. Okay, that's cool. Me va, me va a hacer falta estudiar. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'll give you something else tomorrow. Mañana le voy a dar algo más para, so you can practice. Okay. And the, the and we will continue communicating to the WhatsApp group. Y podemos comunicarnos aún por el WhatsApp group. I mean, there are many things that we can do. Hay muchas cosas okay. que podemos hacer. So don't worry about it. I mean, this doesn't end here. Esto no termina acá, okay? We are going to give it a follow-up. Vamos a dar un seguimiento. Okay. Just Mucha I'm... tarea. <laughs> yeah, it's not like a lot. Look, I mean... For you to not to lose the rhythm, para que no pierdan el ritmo, 10 minutes, 10 minutes a day, 10 minutitos. I mean, at least that way you keep it. Al menos de esa manera lo mantienen. Perfect, entonces. Ah, it's going to be fun. You, you'll see, you'll see. Va a ver que va a ser divertido. Welcome, Clara. Nice having you here. Bienvenida. Thank you. Mónica Liliana Ocotán. Hello, how are you? Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you? Suso, so so. So so. Okay, hey, let's see, let's see. Mónica, I need to talk to you. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Monica, you are missing the final exam. Mande. You are missing the final exam. Me falta el examen final in the platform. Okay. After section four, después de la sección cuatro. Ah. Todavía no lo he terminado. En yes. eso. Please, please, tonight. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, because it's, uh, I mean, if you need any help, let me know. Si necesita alguna ayudita, me avisa, okay? Okay, teacher. Because I have a couple of you here that still have it. Tengo un par acá que todavía les falta un poquito de trabajo ahí. Well, 
And tell me, Monica, how are you? How's everything? How was your day? ¿Cómo estamos? Cansado. Tired? Okay, say it with me. I am tired. Tired. Oh, really? Why? ¿Por qué? What did you do today? ¿Qué hizo hoy? Um, ¿Cómo se dice muchas cosas? Many things. Many things. Like what? ¿Cómo qué? Se lo diré en español porque es muy largo. <risa> este, como me incapacité, entonces me quitaron la operación. Entonces, uh -huh. no sé, me andan como comodín. Oh. Really? So they move you from place to place. La mueven de lado de uno a otro. Exacto. Oh. Well, you gotta see it as a new experience. Vos te velo como una nueva experiencia, I mean. Mi único impedimento es que me duelen las heridas todavía. Y por lo demás estoy acostumbrada. Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean. Uh, so sorry to let you know. Lamento informarle, that's not gonna pass soon. Eso no pasa rapidito. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, the good thing is that you are in good health. Lo bueno es que hasta saludable. I mean, a little bit of pain, uh, but you are there. Poquito dolor, pero ahí está. A comparación de cuando salí, estoy bien. Yeah, sure, sure. You are, uh, 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 I got a phrase. Tengo un modismo. Esto lo van a ver más adelante. Los modismos son expresiones que utilizamos en los idiomas que no tienen sentido gramaticalmente, o sea, no tienen sentido. Sí, gramaticalmente son oraciones, pero no, no tiene que ver con la idea que transmiten. Como un mm -hmm. dicho. Ok, you are in tip-top shape. Let's see, an equivalent for that. Un equivalente para eso. Un alumno me dijo en una ocasión. Está um, very nice. ¿no? ¿Cómo me dijeron? De toque. Así me dijeron. Ok. You are like, compared to the beginning, now you are in tip-top shape. Comparado con la recién salida, <laughs> ahorita está in tip-top shape. Ok. If we say that somebody is in tip-top shape, that person is very good. I mean, you pass by the, surge, by the surgeon and you are here. That's a lot. Pasó por el cirujano y está aquí. That's a lot. That's something to be happy for. Eso es algo que estar alegre. Monica, welcome. Nice having you here. Okay, teacher. Okay. Yes, Karen Martinez. Hello. I saw Karen like this. Yeah, yeah, me, me. La vida está levantando la mano. Hello, Karen. How are you? Very good. Tell me. How's everything? How was your day? Um, I am tired. Bien pesado. Oh, really? Uh, it's Tuesday, eh, martes. I mean, we feel the week that it's very long. Si es martes, no? Yeah. We feel the week that it is very long. Sentimos que le falta un montón. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, but you know, well, I told you once, I guess, yo les decía en una ocasión, for me, the hardest is tomorrow. Para mí el más duro es mañana. <laughs> yeah, for me tomorrow is like, oh man. <laughs> es el que yo siento que, uff, terrible, terrible. I mean, Tuesdays I'm like, mm, whatever. Los martes estoy resignado. <laughs> but Wednesday I feel like, man, this day never ends. Siento que ese día nunca acaba. Martes. No, Wednesdays. Miércoles. Ah, miércoles. Yeah. On Thursday, I'm like, cool, this is over. Los jueves, no, hombre, esto ya estuvo. 
Because Friday I feel like goes fast. El viernes se me va rápido. El viernes happy para nosotros. Feliz. <laughs> I can imagine. I can I can remember. Yo me acuerdo de ese entonces. No while ago. But I remember. <laughs> well, Karen, nice having you here and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Okay, guys. Let me get the attendance. Déjenme tomarles la asistencia, please. Alison Margarita Ávila López. Carlos Jonathan Valladares Mancía. Present. Thank you. Carlos Giovanni de Pasayala. Clara Marina Sánchez Moreno. Present. Dani Abigail López Amaya. Present. Erika Michelle Escamilla Erazo. Present, teacher. Fátima Lisset Pineda Paniagua. Present, teacher. Thank you. Francisco Alexander Maravilla Melgar. Present. Gloria Beatriz Pérez Alfaro. Gloria. Not here. Gustavo Enrique Montoya Rivera. Jaime Enrique Flores Sánchez. Present. José Edgardo Miranda Guardado. José Leonel Asensio Llanes. It's right here. Jocelyn Abigail Rodríguez López. Present. Julia Margarita Varillas Valladares. Present. Karen Tatiana Menéndez Aguirre. Present. Karen Zuleima López Martínez. Present. Carla Beatriz García de la O. Present. Katherine Guadalupe García Chachagua. Present. Livni Rocío Rivera Lemos. Manuel Mauricio Martínez Peñate. Mónica Liliana Ocotán Barahona. Present. Nelson Stanley Cardona Hernández. Present teacher. Patricia Verónica Linares Mengíbar. Roxana Elizabeth Ramírez Lima. Present teacher. Víctor Alberto Trujillo Cruz. Present. Wendy Cecilia Guevara de Rivera. Present. Yuri Magdalena Villanueva de Trinidad. Present. Ok, perfect. Let's see. Excellent. Ok, guys. Now, let's see. Eh, perdón, voy a hablar en español un momento. Necesito dar un anuncio. El día de mañana nosotros tenemos nuestra última clase. No sé si ustedes ya han tomado antes cursos con INSAFOR, pero en la última clase siempre hacemos la encuesta de satisfacción. Es, a ustedes creo que ya les tienen que haber enviado un enlace, eh, les tiene que haber caído un correo. En el correo aparece una información. A ver, es importante que ese correo lo tengan listo porque vamos a... Hay, alguna de la información va a ser de copiar y pegar. Yo el día de mañana voy a estar dando las instrucciones, todo, todo el proceso se lo voy a explicar antes de ello. Vamos a estar aquí y también va a haber alguien de soporte que nos va a acompañar durante ese proceso. Ahora bien, eso es algo que se realiza juntos en ese momento. Please, please, please. Así que por favor, eh, yo les voy a estar avisando mañana al inicio de la clase en qué hora, en qué momento es el que tenemos asignado para realizarlo. Les repito, lo vamos a realizar juntos el día de mañana. Yo sé que algunos dicen, quizás algunos ya tomaron curso y ya saben cómo se hace, pero please, me esperan mañana. Lo hacemos juntos. Es la indicación. Este, algo importante es que tenemos que, al final, cuando ya lo enviamos, nos aparece a nosotros de enviado. Le vamos a tomar una captura de pantalla a eso y esa captura de pantalla se comparte en el grupo con el nombre de cada uno completo. Entonces, eso lo vamos a realizar el día de mañana. Nuevamente le repito, lo vamos a hacer con calma, todos juntos y con mucho cuidado porque nos permiten una vez. ¿Ok? Así que, bueno, ese era el anuncio. Let's see. Ah, let's continue. Thank you. Let's see. Uh, 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 um, 
Fátima Paniagua, hello. Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm fine. Okay, great. How was your day? ¿Cómo estuvo este día? Uh, tired, como uh, siempre. Tired as usual. And tell me, what did you do? ¿Qué hizo? Uh, working. Mucho working. No sé cómo a se lot, dice. Mucho a trabajo. lot. A lot. A lot of work. A lot of work. Really? So it was a heavy day for you. Fue un día pesado para usted. Eh, sí, <laughs> mucho. Okay, well, yeah, we've been talking about that. Tuesdays are like that. Los martes son algo así, ¿no? Todos los días para mí. <laughs> ah, come on. No, Fridays are happy days. Los Fridays son happy days. <laughs> No me diga que no. Fridays, everybody's like, yeah, Friday. <laughs> okay, okay, well, let's see, let's see. And tell me, uh, what time did you start working today? ¿A qué hora comenzó ahora? Start working, comenzar. And seven. Okay. Ten. A las diez. No, seven. Oh, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> your, your co-workers were like, mm. sus compañeros están como, ¿cómo fue? Why? ¿Dónde dan ese horario? Okay, what time did you finish? Uh, four, three, thirty. Okay. Four, thirty. That's fine. What time did you get home? Um, five. Igual bien cerca. Okay, okay. Oh, cool for you. Qué bueno. Well, nice having you here. Bienvenida. I hope you enjoy the class. Espero que disfrute la clase. Thank you. Okay, let's see. Jocelyn, hello. Hi, teacher. Hello, how are you? I'm fine, and you? Ah, just fine, just fine. Aquí, aquí, and tell me, how was your day? ¿Cómo estuvo ese día? My day... Wow. A good day? So, buen día? No. Heavy? <laughs> Pesado? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. Well, you know. Yeah, sorry. That's life, no? Yeah. Yeah, pena es mal. Nah, don't worry. I mean... Tuesday goes fast. Esto ya se fue. Tomorrow is Wednesday. And then it's almost over. Y luego después del miércoles se acabó esto. So, tell me, what do you plan to do on the days that you're not going to have class? ¿Cuál es su plan para los días when you are not having class? Cuando no tenga clase. Um... I, I read and I learn English because I work in my pronunciation and I listen to music in English. That's all. Okay. That's cool. Relax, mostly. Yeah. Que todo relax. Okay, okay. That's cool. Eso es bueno. Excellent, and welcome to the class. Thanks. Thanks to you. 
Let's see, let's see. Hey, Victor. Hello. Hello, teacher. How are you, mister? Very well. Okay, and tell me, how was your day? Good, very good. Okay, what did you do? Uh, work, and work. Work, and work, and work. And work. Uh, welcome to the club, my friend. Bienvenido al club. Only work. Yeah. Uh, Yes, only work. Okay, and tell me, what about for the days after class? What you gonna do? ¿Qué va a hacer cuando terminemos clases? In red, um, watching movies que no he visto. Okay, hey, watching movies, that's nice. Uh -huh. That's excellent. Okay, what? Tell me one movie that you would love to see. Dígame uh, uno. John Wick, what? Four. Okay. Which is John Wick Four? <laughs> Parabellum is the tree. Yeah. Okay, there's. Yeah. Mm, I need to watch that one too. Necesito verlo entonces. Ok, excelente, excelente. Eh, no. Tell me another one. Mencioneme otra. Uh, Top Gun. Top Gun. Oh, that's cool. Ok, what's so your favorite type of movies? Action movies. Mm, drama, no sé. Ok. My favorite movie is The Good Father. Oh, that's a good one. Yes, yes, that's a good one. Yes. Esa es muy buena. Yeah, I like it. Well, let's hope you enjoy it. Esperemos que lo disfrute. Welcome. Thank you. Sure. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Carlos Jonathan. Hello, mister. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. And you, teacher? Ah, you know, here, same old story. Acá, como siempre. The same story. Same old story. Working as usual. And tell me, how's life? ¿Qué hay de nuevo? Um, in the afternoon, uh, today in, in the afternoon, uh, raining. Oh, it was oh. raining? Raining, yeah. Oh, so cool. Man. Here where I live, it haven't rained like in more than one week. Aquí no ha llovido como en dos semanas. Yeah, and, and uh, how do you say aquí también? Here too. Here too. Can you hear me, mister? Okay, I guess we're having a little something here with Carlos. Let's see, Michelle, hello. Hello, teacher. How are you? ¿Cómo estamos? Michelle. Hi. Hi, Hi. Tired? Everybody's like this today. 
I'm working. Oh, really? Yes. Ooh. I'm go my home now. Oh, you are finishing. Acaba de terminar. Yes. Okay, okay. Well, we will talk later. Hablamos luego. Okay. Ahorita mismo. Right now. Do you still okay, have time? Okay, thanks. Okay, perfect, perfect. Excellent. Let's see. Catherine, yes. Tell me. Hello. Hello. Okay, how are you? Um, good. Good. I like that. <laughs> Tell me, how was your day? I am tired. You are tired. Mm. Yes. <laughs> Everybody <laughs> feels like that. Yes, yes, yes. A lot of, of work. A lot of work. <laughs> A lot of work? Well, yeah, that's normal, you know. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. We will talk back in 20 years. Hablamos de nuevo en 20 años. Ahí me cuento. <laughs> Pero no me lo va a creer lo que me pasa ahora. Tell me. I am angry. Angry. Ah, angry. Angry, molesta. Sí. Why? You. <laughs> I don't believe you. Entonces no se le nota. Espere, espere. Sí. It's impossible. No for puedo. You. <laughs> es que ya me pasó. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Tell me what happened, El. ¿Qué sucedió? Sí. Pero voy a ver si lo puedo pronunciar bien. <laughs> the materialist was slow in bringing supplies. Supplies. Ah, supplies. Ok, ok. Sí, me di a entender o, o solo inventé yeah. palabra. No. <laughs> this, this, the raw material. La materia prima, dice usted. El materialista. No, no me llevó ligero los yeah, suministros. Fast. Yes, yes. Wasn't provided mm -hmm. fast. Mm, so... Yeah. Okay, that's why you're mad. Y por eso se enoja. Come on, girl. Sí, porque soy de las que dan el trabajo y a la mitad de mi equipo estaba ya sin trabajo. Uh. Por culpa de él. Well, you know, I mean, but it's not your fault. What can we do? Pero voy a agarrar lo positivo. Descansé dos horas. Muy bien. ¿Qué le vamos a hacer? <laughs> ok, well, two hours. Yeah, that's nice. Eso es bueno. <laughs> a two hours break is cool. Un descanso de dos horas es bueno. Nice, nice. <laughs> Very nice. Pero pasé dos horas enojada. <laughs> Come on, girl. Look, <laughs> something that I learn is what I can fix, I fix it. What I cannot, I accept it. Algo que he aprendido es que lo que puedo arreglar, lo arreglo. Y lo que no, lo acepto. Así es. I mean, what can I do? Believe me, believe me. There are worse things in life to get complicated about. Hay más cosas por qué complicarnos. Not for that. <laughs> Catherine, nice talking to you and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Okay, let's see, guys. I just have a chance for one more because today is going to be a lot of speaking. Okay, tenemos que hablar más. Solo me queda tiempo para uno. Let's see, let's see. Dania. Hello, Dania. Hello, teacher. Dania, we were missing you yesterday. Ayer la esperábamos. Sí, no me pude conectar. Mm -hmm. no, no, no llegué a casa temprano. Aha, uh -huh. where were you? ¿Dónde andaba? Tell me, tell me. Where did andaba you go? en mi otra casa. Aha, uh -huh. oh, say what? <laughs> ¿Cómo así? How comes? Ah, es que agarré una casa. Oh, really? Congrats. 
Felicidades, yes. that's cool. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> how old are you, Dania? ¿Cuántos años tiene? Uh, 26. Oh, that's nice. Qué bueno. Yes. Ok, ok. And how's the house? ¿Cómo está la casa? Um, um, sucia, no sé cómo se dice. Uh, nah. Hay que hacer. <laughs> hay que hacer remodelaciones. Yeah, yeah, but those slowly, slowly, slowly. Tómeselo con mm. calma. Sí. Yes. Uh, I mean, look, I've been living here for five, six years. Yo en esta casa tengo como cinco, seis años and I'm still working on it. Aún estoy trabajando. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I mean, every time, every vacation, we got a new project. Cada vacación le metemos un proyecto nuevo. Justicia <laughs> divina. Okay, let me see, let me see. Yeah, 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 yeah. We understand the justice thing. Entendemos lo de la justicia, Michelle, but <laughs> not the moment, not the moment. <laughs> Okay, so take it yeah, easy, take it story. easy. Take it easy, Dania. Okay, welcome to the class. Bienvenida. Thank you, teacher. Well, guys, today, today we're going to have a little conversation. We are going to work with some adjectives. Vamos a trabajar con adjetivos also. And we're going to work with the manual. Tenemos unas cuantas cositas del manual. It's going to be very interesting. We got some very interesting activities to do, to perform today. Let me see. And the first one, we're going to go to the manual. Vamos a ir al manual. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, 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 where is it? Where is it? All right here. Okay. We're going to work with adjectives, okay? Well, first, let's talk a little bit about adjectives. Todos sabemos que es un adjective, right? An adjective is the word that describes something. La palabra que nos describe algo. Like, uh, let's see, like, Jaime's shirt is red, right? Mi camisa de Jaime es roja. Catherine's blouse is black. Daniel's is gray. Clara's is white. You see, the colors are adjectives because they are describing. Now look, uh, Catherine is sleeveless. La de Catherine is sleeveless. Es sin mangas. Okay. Um, I have a long sleeve shirt. I'm wearing a long sleeve shirt. Yo ando una manga larga. Okay. The day is hot. Today is very hot. Ahora está muy caliente. Some of you told me that your day was very heavy. Muchos me dijeron que su día estuvo pesado. So you see, those words are adjectives. Esas palabras son adjectives. So clean, dirty, heavy, soft. Okay. All those words are adjectives. They describe a noun. Describen un nombre. What is a noun? What identifies anything. Lo que identifica cualquier cosa. Like cell phone, my name, Douglas, that's me, right? Computer, cell phone, tablet, okay? The fan, the light, la luz, the house, those are nouns. So the words we use to describe are adjectives, like Dania was telling me, that her house is dirty. La casa estaba sucia, okay? Dirty, adjective. 
So those are adjectives, the words we use in order to to describe something. Las palabras que utilizamos para describir algo. Those are called adjectives. Hasta ahí como vamos. We cool, okay. So let me share with you. In this case, we've been working in the in this unit, in the unidad, we have been working with addresses and places. So we are gonna use some adjectives that refer about places. Vamos a ver adjetivos que se relacionan con lugares. Look, there are comfortable rooms. There is a huge parking lot. There are nice places to rest. There is an illuminated training room. So in this case, comfortable is an adjective. Huge, ancho. Nice, we know that what is nice. Illuminated. These are considered positive because they are saying something good. Eso están diciendo algo bueno. Negative. There is a narrow angosto reception area there are small offices pequeñas there is a disgusting kitchen area there is a smelly mm, huele mal living room cuando decimos que algo es smelly es que huele mal okay so these are adjectives something very important for you to remember is this look algo muy importante que debemos recordar es lo siguiente and it's actually the key in this topic. Es como la clave en este tema. Look, we have the subject plus the verb plus the adjective plus the noun. Okay? Like in the example, como en el ejemplo. Okay, this is a smelly room. So, if you notice the adjective, si nos damos cuenta, the adjective comes before the noun, viene antes de lo que califica. What am I pointing this out? Because in Spanish is the other way around. Se los menciono porque en español es al revés. In Spanish, we first we place the noun and then we place the adjective. Okay? Un día caluroso. Okay? That's in Spanish, right? But in English is a hot day. Okay? Listen. Día caluroso. That's in Spanish, in English. Hot day. You see? The order is opposite as in Spanish. El orden es opuesto al español. Questions? Teacher, eh, yo solo tal vez tengo una duda en ciertas, podemos llamar oraciones que digamos que en inglés no se escriben como sería en español. Creo que es como lo que está diciendo ahorita, como que es, eh, digamos, a la inversa, eh, las palabras como sería en español. Yeah, that's because of the order. Es por el orden, como le digo, el adjetivo va antes del nombre, antes de lo que describe. En Spanish es, en español es al revés. Ah, ok. I mean, like, uh, like as I told you, a hot day. Hot day. Hot es caliente. Day es día. But in mm. Spanish we say it the other way around. Pero en español decimos distinto. Decimos primero día y luego caliente. Right? So, okay. That's just the order. Simplemente es el orden. But keep it in mind. Téngalo en mente. Okay. Okay.
Now let's continue. Continuamos. Okay, guys. Now the exercise we're gonna do. Look, we have here. Uh, uh, we have complete the sentences using the words provided and the correct verb. Okay. Now you are going to use what we saw yesterday and the adjectives. Vamos a unir aquí dos cosas. Lo que vimos ayer. Remember, there is singular. There are plural. Okay. So. How are we going to do it? ¿Cómo lo vamos a hacer? Let me give you one example. Okay? Look, uh, let's do this one. There are clean cafeterias. You see? There are clean cafeterias. In this case, we don't add that much. In este caso, no le agregamos mucho. But like there is in number four, there is a smart meeting room. There is a smart meeting room. Al ser singular, we add a. You see? A. When it's plural, we don't need it. Cuando es plural, no lo necesitamos. Okay, guys, now, for this exercise, you are going to have five minutes. Para este ejercicio van a tener cinco minutos. You're going to work in groups of three members. Vamos a trabajar en grupos de tres. And I'm going to send you the screenshot. Les envío la screenshot in a second. Let's see. And groups are open. Michelle, let's see, veamos a dónde le enviamos.
Teacher, me salí. Ok, who were your partners? ¿Quiénes eran sus compañeros? No, ni vi. Antes de que mandaran la sala, me sacó. Ok, perfect, no problem. Ahorita le envío. Let's see. Y bueno, la tercera ya está. Tere, la, la, la. Bueno, entonces la segunda es is to are. Ayer pusieron they are is a marketing. Eh, solo que eh, no sé, ¿verdad? Pero por lo menos creo que si le ponemos there is jean small, así me está diciendo, ¿verdad? There is a small. No, there is a small jean. Ah, small eh, jean. ¿Verdad que eh, sí es? Es que. There is a small jean. There is. Bye. Es que, se va... es que Francisco me estaba diciendo que solo se le va a poner jean. Pero le digo que es como, es complementar, poner small jean, no solo es una palabra. Uh -huh. Sí, pero le van a agregar el A. There is a small gym. There is a small gym. Yes. Vaya, y en la número... Cinco sería, o la número dos vamos a trabajar. Sería la número cuatro, no. Es que hay otra dos, por eso le decía. <ríe> El nuevo tren. Cher, que es un. No, allá enfrente. ¿Qué? ¿eh? El aire está en la casa de madera. Erhuns, ¿qué significa? Habitación. Habitación. Thank you. Sería there is. There is, there is. Igual que en la primera. Training Ajá. room, which one? ¿Cuál? La two. Training rooms. Ajá, sí. Ok, look, rooms, plural. Plural. The new, the new training rooms. Entonces, there are. are. They there are. are. There are. Enfrente está el otro. Enfrente. Uh, 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 la número cuatro habla es singular. Smart meeting room. Hey, aquí está la de 100 tiros, man. Ahí está la de 100 balas. Bueno, entonces, así vamos Las a quedar. practicamos. Sí, hay que practicarla. Decime la primera. Ay. Ay. There is a small gym. La segunda. There are new training rooms. Um, la tercera. There are clean cafeterias. Cafe cafeterias. Mm. Sí. 
La otra. There is a smart meeting room. Um, there are unpleasant bathrooms. Yo creo que así se dice. Sí, creo que sí. Y la otra, there is a tiny cubicle. cubicle. Yeah. Porque hay cuatro. Ah. Cuatro. Son seis. Six. Ah, pues ahora si querés decimos las vos comenzáis y yo voy a decir las otras. Bueno, there is a small gym. There are new training rooms. There are clean cafeterias. There is a smart meeting room. There are pleasant bathrooms. There is a Tiny, ¿cómo, ¿cómo se decía? Cubicle, creo. Cubicle, bueno, es yes, cubicle. There is a tiny cubicle. Dice la otra muchacha, nunca apareció. Nosotros le estuvimos hablando, pero nunca habló. And perhaps he's having problems. Puede ser que tenga problemas con la comunicación. That happens. La señal ha estado mala. Bueno. No, ahí se las haga ya. Y la, y la de las cinco, unpleasant, se dice. Unpleasant. Unpleasant. Juntas, cubículo de dientes. No entiendo. Sí, de la sexta es eso. Ok, tiny cubicle, tiny cubicle, es un cubículo chiquito. Tiny cubículo, cubículo. Para mí cubículo no es un espacio como una sitio oficina. Sí, Me por eso dice que es a tiny, tiny cubicle, por eso dice que es chiquito, tiny quiere decir pequeño. Ajá. No problem, Libni. Just listen, okay? Today and tomorrow, just listen. That's fine. Okay, let's see. We are just waiting for everybody to come back. Solo esperamos por los demás que vuelvan, okay?
Okay, guys, let's see. Let's do the exercise first. Oops, no, let's get the attendance. Yes, thank you. The attendance. Alison Margarita Avila Lopez. Carlos Jonathan Valladares Mancia. Carlos Giovanni de Pasayala. Clara Marina Sánchez Moreno. Present. Dani Abigail López Amaya. Present. Erika Michelle Escamilla Erazo. Present. Fátima Lisset Pineda Paniagua. Present. Francisco Alexander Maravilla Melgar. Present. Gloria Beatriz Pérez Alfaro. Gustavo Enrique Montoya Rivera. Jaime Enrique Flores Sánchez. Present. José Edgardo Miranda Guardado. José Leonel Asensio Llanes. Thank you, mister. Jocelyn Abigail Rodríguez López. Present. Julia Margarita Varillas Valladares. Present. Karen Tatiana Menéndez Aguirre. Present. Karen Zuleima López Martínez. Present. Carla Beatriz García de la O. Present. Katherine Guadalupe García Chachagua. Present. Libni Rocío Rivera Lemus. Present, teacher. Thank you. Manuel Mauricio Martínez Peñate. Mónica Liliana Ocotán Barahona. Present. Nelson Stanley Cardona Hernández. Present, teacher. Patricia Verónica Linares Mengíbar. Roxana Elizabeth Ramírez Lima. Present. Víctor Alberto Trujillo Cruz. Present. <coughs> Wendy Cecilia Guevara de Rivera. Yuri Magdalena Villanueva Trinidad. Thank you, Wendy. Present teacher. Thank you, Yuri. Okay, guys, let's see. Let's continue. Continuamos. Let's do the exercise. Vamos a hacer el ejercicio. Oh. Okay, here we go. Okay, we have to complete the words. It says here. Let's see. <laughs> Carla Beatriz García de la O, number one. Uh, there is a small gym. There is a small gym. Perfect. Number two goes to Karen Tatiana Menéndez Aguirre. Um, there, they are a new training rooms. There are new training, training rooms. rooms. Yes, there's no a because it's plural. You see? Okay. And a means uno una. Uh -huh, Perfect. Okay. Now, mm -hmm. Karen Martinez. Number three. Mm, there, there are. Uh-huh. Clean. Clean. Cafeteria. Cafeterias. Cafeteria. Perfect. Now, number four, let's see. 
Roxana. There is a smart meeting room. There is there is a small meeting room. A small meeting room. Perfect. Thank you. Now let's see Judy number five. There are embarrassing bathrooms. Un unpleasant, unpleasant. Unpleasant. Unpleasant, unpleasant bathrooms. bathrooms. Perfect. And number six, let's see. Victor, number six, please. There is a tiny cu cubicle. There is a tiny cubicle. Perfect. So you see, guys, very simple, right? There is a small gym. There are new training rooms. There are clean cafeterias. There is a small meeting room. There are unpleasant bathrooms. And there is a tiny cubicle. Questions? Preguntas? Nope. Okay. Hola, hola, teacher. Yes, tell me. En la número cuatro, it says smart. Oh, I'm sorry. Yes, yes, my bad. Perdón. My bad. Disculpen. There is a smart. Yes. Okay, let's do something different. Okay. Um, yeah, the sentence was like this. My bad, my bad. There is, oops. A smart Okay, let's see. Okay, thank you, teacher. Thanks to you, mister. Okay, there is a smart meeting room. Question, guys? No? Okay, perfect. Next exercise, what you gonna do? Now is your turn, guys. You're going to tell a partner a description of all the areas in your workplace. Okay, but as you work in the same place, what you're going to do is this. I'm going to get you in pairs. Lo voy a poner en parejas. And you're going to describe to your partner your personal working area. Me le van a escribir a su compañero su área de trabajo. Okay? Three, four sentences. That's okay. Tres o cuatro oraciones. I don't want like a big, big description with too many details, okay? Three, four sentences, that's okay. So, any question about the activity before I send you to the groups? ¿Alguna pregunta antes de que los mande? No? Okay, let me see. Mm -mm -mm. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. I'm sorry, I just need to. Oh, 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 okay. Uh, Libni is going to be as a listener. That means that. Okay, let's see. Okay, groups are ready. Let's jump in.
Michelle, apágueme la cámara y la voy a enviar al grupo. Sí, ahorita voy. Voy, voy. Apágueme la cámara. Ok. Thank you, Michelle. Space working Work. uh, in uh, at my space, space. No sé si cómo se dice espacio. Escribe a Maravilla. Sería work in. Ah, es my espacio. ¿Verdad que máquina es ma machine? No. ¿Cómo? Sí, machine. Espacio, a mí me place. Y limpio es clean, ¿verdad? Sí, clean. Ya le caí ahí. Sí, sí, eso. Tengo una mesa. Ay, y yo le dije de una mesa, va. I am table. Sí. I am, no, I am need, need, need. No. I have it. Encontró protector de dedo. Protector de dedo. Finger protector, what's that? <laughs> protector. Finger protector. <laughs> ¿Cómo se escribe? <laughs> finger, dedo, finger. Ah, dedo. Uh -huh. 
Todo que necesiten. Another where they need me. But uh, solo eso. Ahí está José también. Sería your area is eh, where they need eh, it's donde te necesiten. Sí. Is wherever I am needed. ¿Cómo? Okay, my area is. Wherever I am needed. Donde lo necesiten. Thank you. But remember, you are describing your area. Recuérdense, tienen que describirla. ¿Cómo es su área de trabajo? Well, the rest, in his case, because en, en el caso de él, porque es distinto, right? Sí, digamos, sería la descripción. De, de the whole plant. Sería... In his case, is the whole plant. En el caso de él, es toda la planta. No sería lo que uno hace, ¿verdad? No, es describir el lugar donde usted trabaja. Okay. Eh, Víctor, con esta es la segunda, ¿verdad? ¿Cómo? Con esta es la segunda, ¿verdad? La segunda descripción o la segunda oración. Este, más que todo, vos tenés que saberlo. Cuando te pregunte, vas a decir tu descripción y cuando uh -huh. te vos, te digo yo la mía. Ok. Ahí está José también, pero no ha dicho nada. No, he cannot. Él no puede. Ah, ok. Ok. Your area is bodega. Es la bodega, ¿verdad? Yes. It's hot. Muy, muy, muy. Is big. Yo creo que para decir mi área es muy caliente sería my area is very hot, ¿verdad? Yeah. Sí, ¿verdad? Yes. 
Ok. Teacher, para decir mi área es toda la planta. My area is the whole plant. The whole. The whole plant. Yes. ¿Cómo se pronuncia la palabra crítico, teacher, en inglés? What? La palabra crítico. Critic. Sí, crítica. Yeah, Mi área critic. crítica. Critic. 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 Yeah. Ok. Micrófono, teacher. Thank you. Micrófono. Michelle, thank you, thank you, thank you. Michelle, describe your workplace. Que yo qué? Espérame. ¿Qué mando? Dame chula. Describe your workplace. Descríbame su lugar de trabajo. Ay. Sinceramente o, o, o agradeciéndole que me da trabajo. No, the area. <laughs> Necesito que me describa el área, el espacio, ¿ok? Uh, yo había entendido que iba a ser, iba a describir lo que yo hacía. No, your workplace. ¿Dónde usted es que trabaja? Estoy tratando. Ok, my place work is... Ay, ¿cómo le digo? It's for Google. Cubicles. A cubicles. De preparen the supplies. In okay. Cada quien prepara en sus cubículos. Okay. Everybody prepares their cubicle. Okay. Everybody prepares their cubicles. Excellent. It's, it's man is small. Place. Okay, it's a small, excellent. You are using the adjectives. 
Está usando los adjetivos. That's great. And hot. And hot. Well, that's normal. Thank you. Okay, teacher. Let's see. Mm -hmm. uh, who's gonna be next? Judy, describe me your workplace, please. Um, there is a um, narrow, narrow, uh, very is very bossy. Okay, um, uh, there is um, a tiny desk. Tiny desk. Tiny desk. Okay. Tiny desk. Y there is a long computer. Okay, perfect. Excellent. Now let's see Julia. Yeah, teacher. Describe me your workplace, please. My area, actually, my work area is small. It's hot, very, very hot. There are not many people in my work area but it's almost always full of work okay perfect well done excellent roxana hello your turn hello uh, no. The area it is very hot. It is close. So perfect. Thank you. Clara, <laughs> your turn. Hello. Uh, work in a small space. I have a table. There is a small blackboard. There is a ergonomic may. That's it. Perfect. Yes. Thank you. Fatima Paniagua. Uh, working in is my space. And clear clean machine. And there is blue child. If we work. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Let's see. Uh, uh, Stanley, your turn. Hello, teacher. How is the world area? Uh, in my world area, there is a workshop. Uh, the parts warehouse. Uh, in an iPhone to report the machine. Thank okay. you. Perfect. Very well done. Now let's see Jaime, your turn. Okay, in my work area, there is a there is a timer. There are formats, and there is a computer. Is all. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Jocelyn. Um. In my area, there is a big table because I take the finished garment. Also, there are box, boxes and there is a clean place. That's all. Okay, perfect. Excellent. Let's see. Yes, Catherine. Yeah, you can participate. No. Come on. 
my work area is narrow uh -huh. and it is very hot. There is a lot of mud. Yes. And, and there are many clothes. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, 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 Miss Delao. Carla Beatriz, please. Yes, teacher. My work area is neat and clean. Little bit, there are four things or 20 people in each thing. In each thing, there is word drop. Okay, perfect. Thank you. And Dania, you finished, Dania. Uh, my my area performs punks champions and ABC is performing every every hour. The brace are packed by the dozen. By the dozen. By the dozen. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Okay, guys, next activity. Today I told you a lot of conversation. Okay, now I'm going to give you a couple of questions. Okay. Okay, we're going to keep on talking about food. Okay. So three questions that I'm going to give you, give to you. The questions are these ones. Look, what do you eat for breakfast every day? What do you eat when you feel sad? What do you like to drink? Okay, those three questions, you're going to be working in groups. You're just going to have three minutes, exactly three minutes for that. Solo tres minutos para eso, okay? Ask and answer. Preguntar y responder. Your answer must be fast and in English. I'll be jumping from group to group. Voy a ir moviéndome de grupo a grupo. Um, pupusas. Okay, pupusas uh, yeah. every day. And you? Oh, I'm um, breakfast every day. Um, mm, uh, Teacher, how do you say plátano frito? Your microphone. <laughs> Fried plantains. Fried plantain. Fried plantain. Okay. Uh, Jocelyn, um, breakfast every day. Uh, fry. 
plantain. And about you, what do you eat when you feel sad? ¿Qué como usted cuando se siente triste? I don't know. Ajá, <laughs> uh -huh, just um, tell us, tell us. Um, I like eat chocolate. Chocolate. Yeah, and you? Um, ice cream. Mm. Okay, and what do you like to drink? Um, ¿Qué le tomar? Uh, I don't know. So we <laughs> Yeah, I'm like to drink. Eh. Ahí usted puede decirme el que le gusta tomar, ya sea. A soda, a cup of coffee. Water, a juice. coffee. Ah, I drink coffee. Beer. Es que, <ríe> es que pensar me, me pone nerviosa. Alcohol. <ríe> Alcohol. ¿Cómo digo? Ay. <ríe> beer, beer. Jocelyn. <ríe> really? No, that's okay. That's okay. That's fine. I'm gone. Yo mejor me voy. <laughs> Ready, guys? Ready. Ready, teacher. Perfect. Let's go back. Okay, okay, let's see. Vamos a ver. Who's gonna start? ¿Quién va a comenzar? Okay, Clara. Hello, Clara. <laughs> Hello, teacher. Eh... Okay, hold on, hold on. Espéreme, espéreme. Be patient. <laughs> Clara, I need you to ask Catherine. No. <laughs> Pregúntele usted a Catherine. Va, Catherine, va. Catherine, hola. What do you eat for breakfast every day? My breakfast almost every day, turkey ham and cheese sandwich. Oh. <laughs> What do you eat when you feel sad? Hey. <laughs> Frozen. <laughs> what do you what do you like to drink? Uh, coffee with milk. Okay. <laughs> okay, perfect. Now uh let's see, let's see. Jaime, please ask Dania. Okay. Hello, Dania. Hello. What do you eat breakfast every day? My my breakfast breakfast every day is pupusas and coffee. Oh, okay. 
what do you eat when you feel sad? Is candy and soda. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> what do you like to drink? Uh, is water and soda. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Okay, perfect. Thank you. Hey, teacher. Let's see, let's see now. Uh, Francisco, I need you to ask Victor. Okay, ¿quién pregunta? You, Francisco. Oh, okay. Uh, Victor, uh, what do you eat for breast fats every day? I eat beans and eggs every day. Uh, what do you eat when you feel sad? I eat pizza. Uh, what do you like to drink? I like to drink water. Okay, perfect. Right to the point, these guys. Excellent. Monica, I need you to, uh, to please ask Julia. Estaba hablando con el micrófono apagado, lo siento. No worry. <ríe> que le pregunte a Julia. Yes, please. Yo pregunto. Oh, okay. No. Ah, okay. You answer, Julia. Mm -hmm. Ahorita. What do you do? Eight for. ¿Cómo es? What do you eat for breakfast every day? Esa palabra me cuesta. Breakfast. For... Breakfast. Breakfast. Yep. What do you do eat for break... breakfast every day? I, I eat pupusas every day. Or breaks breakfast. What do you do? Every day. Eat when you <laughs> feel sad. I eat chocolate. Hmm. What do you do? Like to drink? Fresh natural. Okay. Every day pupusas. Yeah, yeah, every day. Every day. That's bad. <laughs> That's bad. Okay, let's see. Stanley, I need you to ask mm, 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 Fatima Paniagua. No. Hello. 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 Stanley, you ask. Stanley, pregunta. What do you do eat for breakfast every day? Uh, coffee, white meal, and it's way very hot. What do you do eat when you feel sad? Uh, caramel cake. Oh. What do you do like to drink? And soda. <laughs> Yes, I... Okay. Perfect. Just remember something. Vea las preguntas, Stanley. What do you eat? Usted a todas me les agregó el do después del you. What do you eat for breakfast every day? What do you eat when you feel sad? What do you like to drink? Okay? Yes. What do you What do you do means? ¿Qué what has? do you do? Ese do que está poniendo al final no va. What do you uh, like to drink? Okay, perfect. Okay. Thank you, mister. You're welcome. 
Okay, now let's see. Veamos. Uh, 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 um, who is missing? ¿Qué me falta? Mm -hmm. I know I'm missing someone. Yuri, where are you, Yuri? Hello. Yuri, I need you to ask Carlos Jonathan. Necesito que usted le pregunte a Carlos Jonathan. Ok. Eh, Carlos, what do you eat for breakfast every day? Mm, I'm breakfast every day. Um, mm, I don't remember where... How do you say it? But um, fried, plantain, fried, fried, fried plantain, fried plantain. Okay. What do you eat when you feel sad? Ah, uh, when I feel sad, mm, I eat um. Ice cream with with chocolate. Okay. What do you like to drink? Um, I like to drink um soda, uh, use chocolate, and coffee. I'd like more coffee. Okay, Carlos. Okay, Judy. Thank you. Now let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Karen Martinez. Hello, Karen. Hello, teacher. Okay, I got a different question for you. Tell me, what fool do you hate? What food do you hate? Hate. That's an adjective. It means odiar. What food do you hate, Karen? Hola. What food do you hate? ¿Qué me está diciendo? <laughs> hate es el adjetivo odiar. Food, comida. What food do you hate? My head, my foot head. I hate. I hate. Uh, papaya. Oh, man, that's delicious. Why don't you like it? Por qué no le gusta? Por amarga. Man, that's the good part. So you don't like isote either. Oh, no. Mm. That's bad. That's bad. Thank you, Miss Roxana. What about you? What food do you hate? Tell me. Um, la contesto largo, Jorge. Up to you, my dear. Uh, berenjena. Hate, oh. hate, hate. Why not? No. no. Why? But why? Pero por qué? Usted no la paso, como y lo vomito. Really? Ya le he probado y hasta que vomito y la saco estoy en paz. Mm, that's weird. Qué raro. I like it. La remolacha ah. tampoco me gusta, pero es Or... la paso. That's even more delicious. That's, I eat it as a fruit. Yo me la como como que fuera fruta. En, en ensalada. No, sí. I like it just like that. A mí me gusta solo así. Delicious. Okay. Como, no sé, como... eh, that's okay. That's okay. Everybody's different. Todos somos distintos. Don't worry. 
I mean, there's people who like pupusas every day. Hay gente que le gusta las pupusas todos los días. I mean, you see, everybody's different. Okay, let's see. Jaime, what about you, Jaime? What food do you hate? ¿Qué comida uh, ya sabe la señora que no le prepara? I, I hate fritada. Oh, really? Es guacala. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, I, I don't like it either. Yo tampoco me como eso. No. Yeah, yeah. But some people love it, right? Yes. Some people really love it. Okay, but let's I... see. In your case, is a big no no. No, no. Nah, that's normal. I mean, everybody's different. That's okay. <laughs> let's see. Francisco, what about you? What food do you hate the most? Mm, I hate y como se dice ajo garlic garlic really you don't like garlic no teacher why not lo odio no 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 lo odio it's not for you no no para mi no fue el ajo para mi no es el ajo ok ok no lo paso as I told you everybody's got a little bit different todo el mundo es un poquito distinto that's ok thank you Okay, yeah, man, I love garlic bread. I mean, me encanta el garlic bread. Para mí, pupusas and pupusas. Mm, uh, that's so bad. Lo siento. I'm so sorry for you. I'm kidding. I'm <laughs> kidding. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Um, Wendy. Hello, Wendy. I haven't talked to Wendy today. Hi, teacher. Tell me, Wendy, what food you don't like? ¿Qué es lo que no le gusta? Pescado eh, envuelto en eh, huevos. Oh, yeah. Eh, that's, oh, my gosh. That's <laughs> terrible for me, too. Oh, really? I never eat that. <laughs> y este... Quiero ver qué más... No, realmente como un poco de todo, solo eso, si no. Oh, really? Yeah, no. Sí. That wasn't done for me. Eso no fue creado para mí. Ni para mí. Yeah, no my thing. Me gustan los mariscos, amo los mariscos. Pero este pescado seco no me gusta. Yeah, but some people love it. In my house, they love it. En mi casa les encanta. Mm, igual que en la mía. Do you cook it? <laughs> La galleta. No, do you cook it? ¿Usted lo cocina? No, mi mamá. Ah, oh, ok. O sea, yo sí cocino, pero mi mamá cuando hace eso, mi hermana sí. ya no nos gusta y nos hace otra cosa. Ah, uh, oh my gosh, so pamperel, <laughs> so pamperel, <laughs> pamperel, qué consentida. <laughs> en cuanto a la comida. <laughs> ok, pamperel. Means to pamper someone, pamper is like in the, in the, in como en los pañales, no? Mm -hmm. Disposable diapers, uh, pamper is consentir. Mm, como un bebé. Yeah. yeah. Okay, guys. Well, thank you very much. Oh my gosh, it's time. Wow. Let me get the final attendance. A ver, les recuerdo, mañana tenemos la última clase, nos conectamos todos, tempranito, no se me van a ir. ¿Ok? Hey, teacher, antes yes. que continúe, ¿cómo se dice sopa de pata? That would be calf, calf soup. ¿Cómo se escribe? Calf. Sí, porque es todo el tobillo, ¿no? Calf soup. Calf soup. Yeah. Okay. I have never had to translate that. Yes, Tani. Creo que se le quedó fijo, Tani. Profe. Eh... Anda en el día, te dijo cómo hacerlo en la encuesta. No, 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 en la clase, durante la clase. Oh, 
Ok, pero... la, la encuesta la vamos a realizar acá durante la clase. Ok, guys. Thank you. You're welcome. So let's see the attendance. Alison Margarita Ávila López. Carlos Jonathan Valladares Mancilla. Present. Carlos Giovanni de Paz Ayala. Clara Marina Sánchez Moreno. Dania Abigail Present. López Zamaya. Thank you, Clara. Present. Thank you. Erika Michelle Escamilla Erazo. Present, teacher. Pati Maliset Pineda Paniagua. Francisco Alexander Maravilla Melgar. Present. Gloria Beatriz Pérez Alfaro. Gustavo Enrique Montoya Rivera. Jaime Enrique Flores Sánchez. Present. José Edgardo Miranda Guardado. José Leonel Asensio Llanes. Jocelyn Abigail Rodríguez López. Present. Julia Margarita Varillas Valladares. Present. Karen Tatiana Menéndez Aguirre. Present. Karen Zuleima López Martínez. Present. Carla Beatriz García de la O. Present teacher. Catherine Guadalupe García Chachagua. Present. Libni Rocío Rivera Lemos. Present teacher. Manuel Mauricio Martínez Peñate. Mónica Liliana Ocotán Barahona. Present. Nelson Stanley Cardona Hernández. Present Patricia Verónica Linares Mengíbar. Roxana Elizabeth Ramírez Lima. Present. Víctor Alberto Trujillo Cruz. Present. Wendy Cecilia Guevara de Rivera. Present. Yuri Magdalena Villanueva de Trinidad. Present. Well, thank you very much, guys. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Lo veo mañana. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night, teacher. 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 Good night,
Ok, what a shame that nobody connected. Qué mal que estos chicos no se me han conectado. But it's almost time to finish. And let's finish the class.